good good afternoon um, I just thought I'd reply to this comment right here I thought this was a good one um, make temp has been doing just that for decades so now how does make temp dash D compare to SF let's take a look so SF boom two letters and I'm in right so why I, I use this a lot if I want to like clone something oops if I can spell Y finder that would be um, I do this a lot I, I'm constantly cloning things um, and so you can see um, you know this is just today the things I've cloned today so the nice thing about SF is that it always puts you in a new it creates a new directory um, if one doesn't exist, if it does exist for that particular day, it just jumps you right in that one. So at the end of all this, you're going to have a nice number of folders. So it kind of keeps you, your thing organized. Now, if I do make dir temp, okay, so now a couple problems. Well, first, I've got, I've got this, sorry, make temp D. So I have this folder, but now I have to like CD into there. Right, so it doesn't dump, it doesn't change directory automatically, as far as I know. Maybe there's an option to do that. It's also way more letters. Make temp dash d. Um, now, of course, you can alias that for sure. So I can, so let's not hold that against it. I can you know alias it to md. But um, you know this this is just kind of a random temp directory. So um, so sf is kind of not not to be these are scratch pads but sometimes you want to graduate a scratch pad to to something more permanent and this kind of gives you that so that's that's it hope that helps cheers